disabled veteran gets devastating news. Her service dog has cancer. And then, just hours later, she finds out that somebody's broken into her car. Fox News Natalie Fultz has her story and her efforts to track down the crook who targeted her car. Teresa Barnes says times are tough financially. She says she's now forced with the decision to get her dog the surgery that she needs or to get her car fixed. Good girl, Gabby. Okay. Teresa Barnes knows all about battle. Here, she spent seven years in the Go Army, ahead. 15 in the National Gabby. Guard, and even did a tour cool. in Iraq. Being overseas, I lost my sense of security. Um, so for about two years after coming home, I wouldn't leave my house. With her service dog, Gabby, by her side, that all changed. But Thursday, Barnes got devastating news. Her pup has cancer. She needs to have surgery. They want to remove the tumor before it starts to spread. After hearing the diagnosis, Barnes decided to take Gabby on a walk. Barnes didn't know that she was just minutes away from becoming a victim of a car break-in. On her way back to the car, and about halfway there, I see someone closing the passenger side of my door. Barnes wasn't able to catch the crook, um, but this is the damage. This is the window that was broken. It was completely smashed. Now Barnes is left with a tough choice. I have to choose between giving her her surgery that could save her life or getting the windows in my car repaired um, so that I can go to doctor's appointments. And nobody should be forced to have to make a choice like that. DeKalb County Police tell me they do not have a sketch of the suspect and no warrants have been issued, so they're asking anyone with any information to come forward. In Lithonia, Natalie Fultz, Fox 5 News.